Well, good morning, everybody. Uh, today I'm going to do a, a real quick flight showing you how to do an approach with a GNS 530. Uh, a few planes have it, not too many, but it's a, a nice little unit. Right now we're sitting at Niagara Falls, New York. Uh, we're going to fly over to St. Catharines, Ontario, and I got to do this quick. You see, I got some planes waiting behind me. The busy airport. We jump into the cockpit, and this is the uh, Paranata Piper Navajo, similar to the Chieftain, but I think I like this one a bit more. But what I like about the Navajo, it comes compatible with the G GTN 750. So you see, I can go up here to plugins, GTN 750, select it, and it'll load it into the airplane. So now you see, I've got the GTN 750. But we're not going to use the 750, we're going to use the GNS 530. So I can go in here and I go to GTN and I can shut it down. We're going to use this 530 to show you how to do a real quick approach with the 530. So we've got to set up a flight plan. So the first thing you do is you click on flight plan. You see we've got our airport that we're sitting at, KIAG Niagara Falls. So you see the center cursor here. Click the center. You see how it's not highlighted. To move down to the next line of your flight plan, you got to have the top thing, top one highlighted. So you click the center of your cursor and highlight it. Then you could use the outer wheel of your cursor and you can move down to the next line. And then move to the inner inner line, inner circle. As soon as you use your mouse wheel, you can start putting in your next waypoint, which is going to be St. Catharines, CYSN. So I move my mouse wheel and you see, then I can select the letter. And it is CY outer ring, move next spot, inner ring, the Y, outer ring, next spot, inner ring, outer ring, down to end. As we're going to fly over to, we're going to fly over to St. Catharines. So click enter. Accept it? Yes, enter. So here we're going, Buffalo, uh, Niagara Falls over to St. Catharines. So it's a direct, all we need now is the approach, because it's only, see it's only 11, 11 miles, not very far. So now what we want to do is we want to get our approach. So you click on procedures, use the outer ring of your cursor, go down to select approach, enter it. And we're going to land on, we've got two choices with this GPS. Uh, runway 6 or runway 24. We're going to land on runway, runway 24. So you use your auto ring, select runway 24, load it, yes, enter. And we're going to go to Bogus. You have a choice of vectors, and what you do is when you get a bunch of vectors, you can play with them and find out which one you like best. You just got to go through them and load them and look at them and see if you like it. And I've discovered that Bogus is the best one, so save some time so click on bogus load it load it there's our approach load the approach load it so there it's loaded now you see right here how our original flight plan showed it's going direct over to St. Catharines well, we want it to go to the beginning of our approach so the way you do that you click on procedures again and you use the outer wheel and you move up to activate. Now you want to activate it. Activate. Now you see it's changed from going to St. Catharines direct. Now it's going to go over here to the beginning of your approach. And the other thing you got to do is so that the autopilot will, will see it. Because this is a GPS. See down here where it says V-Lock. You've got to change that to GPS by clicking on the CDI button. See, now it's in GPS. Now the autopilot will see this. And that's pretty much all there is to it. All we got to do now is take off and set the autopilot and away we go. So let's get at it. And I'm not going to go very high because it's only a 10 mile flight over to uh, St. Catharines. I just picked these two airports because they're close together and it'll be a short video. It's very simple to set up an approach with the GNS 530. 
similar to the 430, but the 530 here has a map. Rotate. Gear up. Autopilot. I'll turn towards the uh, boat. Autopilot on. Hold altitude. Flight director. Nav. Approach. Back my speed down a bit. You were climbing. You're pretty good. Pretty good speed. You see it's heading for our approach. Now this is pretty close to sea level, this area. So right now we're at 1,500 feet. <laughs> but that should... Uh, that should start bleeding off once we're into our approach. This is Niagara Falls over here. And you can see I'm using ortho. locked onto our flight plan. Like I said, you just gotta remember that this says GPS down here. V lock it won't it won't see the flight plan. Some of that speed off we're doing 150 knots here. Watch this. Make that a little smaller. Play with my throttle. I'm not flying the plane. The plane's flying itself. I'm going to go to Vogus and it's going to turn over to the blue, the blue. Plane's turning itself. I'm not turning it. Got a bit of a cold this morning, so excuse my sneezing and stuff. to Lirlu. ETA to Lirlu. Two and a half minutes. Two minutes now.
3.7 miles. out over Lake Ontario. sitting here like a passenger watching the plane do its thing. This southern Ontario is pretty flat. Leading altitude, not losing it. I mean, the ground's a little higher over here by the airport. We're on final. I'm 
watching here, be really to Aphnis. Now when it hits Aphnis, it might, it might be the last waypoint before the runway. See, we're bleeding off altitude now. 10 seconds to the next waypoint. Setting them one minute. Two miles to setting them. And you can see we're losing altitude. seconds to set them, set them, set them, here it says 13 seconds, direct track, okay now we're going, set them to runway 24, two miles, we put the gear down, Couple knots of the flaps. See the wind shaking the plane in the gear. See right here, we're right on the glide slope. I can minimize this. The plane still got control. I, I'm just watching it. I don't have control. I'll get ready with the autopilot so I can shut it off and we get close. A little on the runway and then I'll shut it down. So this is a precision, uh, a GNS 530 precision approach. plane's still flying itself. plane's still flying itself. Pilot off, brakes on, and that's how you do a precision approach with the GNS 530. Welcome to St. Catharines. Hope you like it.